In this video, we're going to unbox the 9999 SP2R Pilot Light Kit for your NEMA 1 enclosed uh, Type S starters. Um, as you can see, I have a clamshell enclosure here. We're going to install the Pilot Light to the coil and the lens to the actual enclosure body. I already have the knockout made. So when we open the device up, you'll get a kit, a full kit. It comes with instruction bulletins. You'll see here you'll get your pilot light coil, a lamp and socket. You'll get both a red and green lens cap, as well as the lens itself and the retaining spring. So the first part, what we're going to install, is actually going to be this pilot light coil and the socket and lamp. What we do for that is we're going to, on your NEMA 1 starter, or your enclosed starter itself, I have a size zero here, we're gonna undo the two cover mounting screws. Take that cover off. We're gonna remove the coil, armature, and magnet assembly from the device. And the actual instructions are just to remove the magnet itself. Take your coil, you're gonna position it right beside the coil of the starter itself and slide your magnet assembly right back in. Then you're gonna reinstall the whole assembly of coil, magnet, armature, and now you have the, mag the pilot light coil. And then reinstall your cover plate. These two little stabs here will actually install right here on the socket itself. And install it from the top down, like so. All right, and this actually uses an induction current when your coil is energized to give the indication that your pilot light is on and that your starter is closed or your coil is getting voltage. For the lens itself installation, it's very, very easy. What you'll do is you'll knock out the top portion of your clamshell box and your lens actually installs with your lens piece. We're going to use red for the lens cap. You'll snap this in place right here. This installs through the top mounted hole and from the back side of the box you'll actually install your retaining spring right here and then push it and in the center. And now you have the installed pilot light lens. 